Welcome back guys, this is Tyler from ORATS and today I'll be showing you how to backtest a diagonal calendar spread using leg relationships. Understanding what drives the profit of diagonals can be a powerful strategy in the investor's toolbox. Using the payoff diagram and observing the profitability in backtests can help you understand this more advanced strategy. Diagonal option spreads can be thought of as a variation of a vertical spread adding a calendar aspect. That is, setting the two legs of the spread to have different expirations. To be capital efficient, we will make the long leg be the longer dated leg. By having the short leg be the shorter dated, the theta of the spread or the amount the options go down in price after a day passes, will often be more positive. Here's how to test this in ORATS. Let's head to the backtester in Wheel and create a new backtest. We'll go with the default symbol and select Long Call Calendar from the list of strategies. In the Review Parameters section, you'll notice that the days to expiration for each leg are different, but the strikes are the same. This works great for regular calendar spreads, but not if we want to backtest a diagonal, where the legs each have different strikes. We want to change the value of the back month leg, which in this case is going to be the long call. The front month leg is already targeting the 0.5 at the money delta, so we want to make the back month leg target more out of the money. We'll set this to 0.3. Then open up the additional parameters tab and go to leg relationships. Click Edit Leg 1, Leg 2 Strike Width. If we keep this at zero, our previous change wouldn't work, so we just have to tell the backtester to remove any restrictions on strike selection. Setting this to negative 99 and positive 99 will do the trick. You can also play around with the days to expiration leg relationships. Setting the max value of this parameter will tell the backtester if the legs should be one week apart, one month apart, or any other value. I went ahead and tested two different back tests, one with 14 days as the value for this parameter, and one with 30. The one with 30 days performed slightly better, and it had trades going back to 2007. The one with 14 days only started trading in 2014. It's also helpful to visualize these strategies using the payoff diagram available in the scanner. If we scan for this diagonal spread we just created, and then click Trade on the first result, we'll see this payoff diagram pop up you'll see that the max profit of $143 matches the short strike when the trade is simulated to be exited. That's it for this video. To learn more quick tips about our products, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.